Hi, Christiana from the coming. Nice to Hi, meet you. What are you looking forward most from tonight? Other than having a glass of champagne, um, I'm really excited to be part of um, a celebration which is honouring a, a real, a, a probably diverse range of people actually I think this year and to be at a moment when, you know, we're, we're in a group of people who are to watch and um, the lovely thing about that is that you feel like we're on the cusp of a lot of really exciting things because I think cinema and the film industry is changing very quickly at the moment, particularly in reaction to Time's Up and Me Too and there's a real push towards making more films with more different voices for a wider audience and it's lovely to be part of that. As a woman it's really uh, an exciting time but I also think that we're, we're all realising how important it is to hear stories from all sorts of different places and all sorts of different voices and one of the lovely things about what the Newport Film Festival is doing is really supporting that. So it's great. How does it feel to be among the 10 Brits to watch? I'm delighted. Um, particularly because as a writer and a director, quite often you're sort of, you know, you're behind the camera. And so um, to be in the company of lots of actors is always a lovely place to be. But it's, it's really special to be included on that list when you're normally, you know, tucked out the back doing your work. Um, it's, it's really exciting. And there's some fantastic people on the list this year. So I was really um, flattered to be included. Can you tell us a little bit more about what you're currently working on? Sure. I'm in the final stages of a film called Summerland, which is my first feature as a director, and uh, which is an original feature which I wrote. And actually, well, I wrote while I was on a, um, an award scheme from BAFTA. And one of the great things that this country does, I think, um, is to support people who are at an early stage of their career by encouraging them to take a leap. And I only wrote the film um, with BAFTA support. I wouldn't have written it had they not given me an award to have a go at writing a screenplay. So um, I think that was, a, that was something that was really exciting. But we're now in the final stages. Uh, we shot over Christmas and we... Um, Lionsgate and the BFI are producing, so we're really excited about now sharing it with the world. It's set on the cliffs of the South of England, so we had a summer of glorious weather, and now we're in a very dark, very small room for months at a time. Um, but it's just, it's lovely, and, and because I wrote the screenplay, to be able to tell the story from the very beginning, it's just and now it's a fully fledged film on the cinema screen. It's a journey like no other. And actually, I really have back to thank you because I wrote it on the first week. Okay. Um, where they were looking for playwrights who they thought should be writing in film. So actually, it, it's really not without organisations like that giving people the opportunity um, to be able to bring it up. So, thanks. <laughs> Yeah, I think we're um, hoping for festivals later this year. And like I said, we're still in the edit, so we're sort of, my head is full of the cut and how we're going to put it all together. But thank you, we've got an excellent team working on it. Lionsgate are um, all cases and distributors. So we've got some lovely, and the BFI is being tremendously supportive because we're one of the films that they um, gave a big watch of money to last year. And it's nice as a first time director to be trusted with that. So completely mad. It's, it's such a joyful um, group of people and a uh, project because people love it. And to be able to make something that's educational and fun and silly. You kind of act like a kid when you're writing it. You think, well, what would have made me laugh when I was small? And then you show it to people, and actually, adults love that just as much as kids do. It's, it's a really, um, it was a, a huge sort of honour to be asked to do it. So I was delighted.